The CCSD superintendent has rolled out an action plan to address ongoing racial issues and threats right here in the Valley. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brian Loftus. I'm Denise Valdez. Tonight, CCSD is taking the next step in combating hate in schools. 8 News Now reporter Shakela Alvarenga tells us how. Well, Brian and Denise, the plan comes after several recent incidents involving racially insensitive comments. One, that threat at Arbor View High School, and then another when school board trustee member Danielle Ford referred to black students as colored. The posts on Instagram were terrifying. The user called for a Columbine Part 2 targeting black students. Nothing like this has really ever happened at this scale in the Clark County School District. Phase one of the solution focused on gathering data, observing how students and staff interact. No child should go to school scared, wondering if they are going to make it home because they've been targeted because of the color of their skin. Our cameras weren't allowed inside for the next phase, where they discussed how teachers and parents can better understand diversity. So we want to own it. Um, that something like this would happen means that there's, there's some things that are under the surface that maybe were not jumping out at us right away, but we need to address. The Anti-Defamation League will host a two-day program at Arbor View High School. We see the rise of racism, bigotry, and anti-Semitism at historic levels. And so these are issues that the ADL is having to address daily. It's the start of a collaborative effort. The hope is that this won't happen again. These are not conversations that we want to be having with our students in 2019, but if they are going to take place, we can't pretend that they're not, and we need to be able to educate our community and our society on why this is not okay. On to phase three. It will begin in the fall with the department's equity and diversity team, who will then assess the district's progress. Reporting live, Shakela Alvarenga, 8 News Now. Back to you.